Well, this is uh, the Buzz UG. My name is uh, Melaz Milo, aka Fuller. Thank you so much for subscribing. And in case you haven't subscribed, kindly subscribe and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. Make sure that you follow me on TikTok. I'm using the same names, Melaz Milo, aka Fuller. Well, before I take you to what is happening in a Bobby Wine's camp, yesterday a police officer identified as David Ogwang attached to counter terrorism uh, shot dead his wife, identified as Jennifer. Yes, this incident happened right there at uh, Ginger Road Police Barracks. And uh, the woman was also a police officer attached to the VIPPU. Uh, that is uh, the very important person protection unit of police. And uh, she was working at Parliament. It's very sad news. And... Uh, the Kampala Metropolitan Police spokesperson, that is uh, Mr. Patrick Onyango, said that, uh, you know, the guy has been arrested. That is uh, David Ogwang. Uh, he's been arrested and right now he's in police custody uh, waiting to be taken to the courts of law, of course, to face murder charges right there. It's very sad and uh, may her soul rest in peace. Away from that, uh, yesterday we received information from that side of Lugazi that a UPDF uh, bus was involved in an accident. Uh, good enough, uh, no life was lost right there, according to the reports coming in from uh, that side. But, um, you know, very many UPDF soldiers uh, were injured, according to the reports circulating on social media. Uh, the spokesperson of a UPDF, that is a Brigadier General Felix Kulaije, hasn't confirmed this accident, that side of uh, Lugazi, but uh, reports have indicated that uh, uh, the injured UPDF soldiers were transferred to Kawolo Hospital where they are right now receiving treatment. Of course, we are still waiting for the UPDF uh, spokesperson, Brigadier General Felix Kulaija, to confirm this accident right there. But as you can see in that picture, that is uh, the UPDF bus that was uh, involved in an accident right there. We haven't known exactly how many UPDF soldiers were injured, but that is it from uh, the UPDF camp. According to the eyewitnesses, they said that the driver was driving on a high speed and uh, that could have caused the accident right there in uh, Ginger, in uh, Lugazi, uh, that is uh, Ginger, Kampala Road. It's very sad and of course we pray for a very quick recovery for the UPDF soldiers who were involved in that accident right there. <music> Well, away from that, coming in from uh, the NUP camp, yesterday, Bobby Wine was in uh, Busia, uh, that is uh, the eastern part of the country. Yes, he's still traversing that side of the country. Uh, you remember the day before he was in Mayuge and uh, he was welcomed massively. And uh, yesterday in Busia, mammoth crowds right there. My God, I no longer have the best words to describe what is happening in uh, Bobby Wine's camp. But of course, uh, as usual, he was welcomed that side of uh, Busia massively and uh, I think today he's going to be in uh, Mbale. Uh, that is where he's going to be. And uh, of course... Uh, the people of uh, uh, Busia yesterday said, yes, we are with you and we support you on the cause you on. And uh, yesterday somebody asked me, do you think Uganda is ripe for change? And I did not answer that question. And I thought, let me bring that question to you on the Buzz UG. In the comment section, of course, you can answer that question. Do you think Uganda is ripe for change? What do you think about what is happening in uh, Bobby Wan's camp? The comment section is very open for you. But anyway, that's what is happening in uh, Bobby Wan's camp. And uh, I think uh, today he's going to be in Mbale in case I get any, uh, you know, highlights right there. I'll be keeping you posted right here on the Buzz UG. My name is uh, Melaz Milo, a.k.a. Fuller. Thank you so much for keeping it right here uh, on the Buzz UG. And uh, just in case you haven't subscribed, kindly subscribe and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. You can also follow me the other side of TikTok. I'm using the same names, Melaz Milo, a.k.a. Fuller. Thank you so much for following me i'm actually about to clock 10,000 followers and i really appreciate i know you're following me because you really want to know what is happening in the country and uh, trust me i'm gonna be keeping you posted on whatever that is trending in the country so make sure that you're part of me 24 7 on the buzz ug and uh, right on tiktok uh, i'll be keeping you posted on what is making headlines in the country for now it is a bye and i'll be right back in another video Audio jungle.